The living donor is a 37-year-old man, scheduled for a left lateral hepatectomy. The graft will consist of segments 2 and 3, and a portion of segment 4, leaving in the donor the caudate lobe, most of segment 4, and the middle hepatic vein. The transection plane will extend from the groove between the middle and left hepatic veins and course approximately one centimeter to the right of the falciform ligament, staying medial to the gallbladder fossa. This ensures that the graft will be of adequate size for the recipient and contain the necessary branches of duct and vessel orifices for reimplantation. Following a retrograde cholecystectomy, a cholangiogram will be performed and the left hepatic artery and left portal vein will be dissected out. When parenchyma division reaches the left hepatic vein, the left hepatic duct will be divided, the patient will be heparinized, and the left hepatic artery divided. The left portal vein will be stapled, the left hepatic vein stapled and divided, and finally the left portal vein will be divided allowing removal of the left lobe graft. The volume of the left lateral lobe graft was calculated to be adequate for the intended pediatric recipient. The graft will contain a single hepatic vein, single hepatic artery, single portal vein, and single bile duct.